assalamu alaikum uh, hello dear students i hope you will be fine happy and healthy today uh, today we are going to talk about the paraphrase and explanation of mother to love poem yesterday we talked about the uh, translation and today we are going to begin the paraphrase and explanation but before paraphrase and explanation let's uh, repeat uh, stanza by uh, let's translate it uh, stanza by stanza and uh, then uh, we will uh, paraphrase and explain it as well so the mother to son ma se bete ko well uh, well son i'll tell you acha mera beta main tumhe bataunga life for me ain't been no crystal stair ke mere liye zindagi ek saap wo hamwar seedi ki tarah nahi rahi hai jis par main upar chalti rahi aur saap wo hamwar seedi thi it had takes and it isme bade bade mothe aur nokdar khel bhi the and splinter aur isme naukili kirchiya bhi the chiptiya bhi the and boards are torn up aur is seedi ke takhte jo the ye toote poote hoye the toote poote hoye the phatte hoye the and places with no carpet on the floor और ऐसे जगहों से मैं गुजरी हूँ जहाँ फर्श पर कोई कारपेट वगैरह नहीं थी बेर बिल्कुल खाली फर्श थी तो यही पहला स्टेंजा है वी हैव टॉक्ड इन द लास्ट पोएम दैट इन द पैराप्रेज वी विल जस्ट चेंज फ्राम वर्स टू प्रोज नसर से प्रोज को हम चेंज कर लेंगे तो जब हम इस स्टेंजा की पैराप्रेज करते हैं सो वी विल से दैट इन दिस स्टेंजा Uh, the mother advises his son uh, that life for me is not uh, very easy i have suffered a lot during my lifetime uh, my uh, life was not like a steer for uh, like a st- crystal steer for me or very easy steer, uh, steer for me there were a lot of nails on the way of climbing the steer Uh, similarly there were a lot of splinter while i was climbing on the life of steer and going ahead uh, there were a lot of uh, torn or broken plane while i was uh, climbing on the steer of life and uh, there were no carpet on the way on which i walked comfortably but the whole land was bare and i suffered all these thing during my life so yahi dear viewers is the a short or that is the paraphrase now we are going to discuss the explanation of this stanza so as you know in explanation there are usually four thing the first of all from which poem the stanza has written who is the writer of that uh, poem or the composer of that poem what's the capsule summary of the poem and then explanation of the given stanza so i have written over here the uh, three thing that uh, reference to the context i have written over here so when this stanza we uh, describe so we will write in this way that this stanza has been taken from the poem mother to son poem ka naam yahi hai Uh, this poem has been composed by longston hughes ye shair ka naam ho gaya and this poet a poem the poet yaha poem hai in this poem in this poem uh, the poet plays the character of uh, the, the the poet plays the character of the role of a mother ek maa ki kirdar ada karti hai shair and advises her son aur apne bete ko नसीहत करती है अबाउट द हार्डशिप्स ऑफ लाइफ जिंदगी के मुश्किल के बारे में उन्हें नसीहत करते हैं एंड इनक्रेज हेम टू कीप ऑन कंटिन्यू स्ट्रगल विद पेशेंस एंड होप और इनको ये हौसला देती है कि अपना कोशिश जारी रखो सब्र के साथ और उम्मीद के साथ द पोएम एक्सप्लोर द डिग्निटी एंड डिटर्मिनेशन ऑफ अ मदर पेस इस प्रॉब्लम तो ये पोएम वही डेग्निटी मीन वक़ार और स्ट्रगल शो करती है एक माँ की 
جو اپنا جو مختلف مسائل کا سامنا کرتے ہوئے آگے کی طرف جاتی ہیں رائٹ سو دیٹ از دا ریفرنس ٹو دی کانٹیکس ناؤ وی آر کمنگ ٹو دا ایکسپلینیشن اینڈ ایکسپلینیشن وی ول ٹاک الٹل بٹ مور فار ایگزامپل ان دس پوئم دا پوئٹ پلیز دا رول آف اے مدر اینڈ ایڈوائس از ہر سن شی سیز ٹو ہر سن دیٹ او مائی سن فار می لائف از ناٹ ویری مچ ایزی وائل آئی واس کلائمبنگ دا لیڈر آف لائف ہیئر دا لائف ہیز بین کمپیرڈ ود لیڈر It is a far-fetched metaphor or it is a, an extended metaphor. Grime was a literature ki roh se yeh ek istiara hai. Zindagi ko uh, un, usne ek uh, seedhi ki tarha uh, tashbih di hai. Ke jayse seedhi par chalna hai. Isi tarha zindagi guzarte hoye bhi hume aage ki taraf jana hai. So in this poem uh, sh- uh, she compares uh, life with a steer and she advises her son Uh, that oh my son this life was not very easy for me while i was climbing on the ladder of life so i faced a lot of hardship and difficulties and while climbing the ladder there were a lot of nails big and th- uh, thick nails upon which i had to go and those nails injured my feet and hand but i continue my going on Similarly, there were a lot of splinter while I was climbing the ladder of life. But I suffered all these uh, splinter and these splinter injured my fingers and my hands and my feet uh, as well. Uh, similarly, then further he says that uh, there were a lot of uh, broken board uh, in the ladder of life. In the ladder of life, there were a lot of uh, planks which were broken and while I was climbing upon these broken claim, uh, these broken um, planes, so it was very much difficult uh, for me to go on. But I didn't lose the courage and I continue my struggle. And further she says that uh, there were a lot of uh, uh, such places uh, which were totally bare and there were no carpet upon these uh, places. But I continue my journey of life and I reach to this height. Now the mother is in a high position. So my dear son, you should also have to suffer all these difficulties of life. If you want to get a good position, to get a high position in your life. So don't be discouraged and continue your struggle uh, in spite of all the difficulties and you will become successful. Now come to the second uh, stanza. But all the time, like in, in tamam aukat mein, uh, I, uh, I see I've been a climbing on, yes, yes, e jo hai, ye purana English hai, aur ye been ka mana deta hai. I've been a climbing on, like in, in tamam waqtou mein, mein ne apna chalna jari rakha. Apne upar ki tarab siri par chalna jari rakha. And reach in uh, laden, aur onchi muqam tak pir mein pounch gai. And turn in uh, corner, and turn and corner our isi munchi muqam tak pahunchne mein maine mukhtalif modon ko mod liye maine mukhtalif jagah talash kiye corner mean mukhtalif atraf se main guzar kar udhar pahunch gayi and sometime go in uh, in the dark aur kabhi kubar mein andhere mein bhi jati rahi is ala muqam tak pahunchne ke liye where there were ain't been no light jahan par koi roshni bilkul nahi thi سو بوائے ڈونٹ یو ٹرن بیک اس لیے میرے بچے تم واپس نہ ہو جاؤ رائٹ ڈونٹ یو ٹرن مطلب آپ واپس نہ ہو جاؤ یہی سیکنڈ سٹینزا ہے سو جب ہم ایکس کی پیرا پریس کرتے ہیں تو وی ول سی دیٹ ان دس سٹینزا دا پوئٹ پلیز دا رول آف اے مدر اینڈ ایڈوائس از ہر سن دیٹ او مائی سن Uh, throughout my life, I continued uh, the struggle of my life by climbing up uh, the ladder. And at last, I reached to the height of the life. I reached to the hi- high place uh, which I wanted to reach. And during this journey, I have turned up so many corners. Uh, I have continued my struggle through so many ways to reach the top. Uh, and uh, sometime I also walk in the dark and uh, to reach my target 
and when I was walking in the dark, so there were no light uh, on the way. Uh, so all these things, keeping in mind all these things, my son, you should also go straight ahead and don't turn back. Yehi is a short uh, paraphrase. Now in the explanation, we will yehi again lick linge. Okay, uh, this stanza has been taken from the poem Mother to Love. Uh, the poem has been composed by Longston Hughes. In this poem, the poet plays the character of um, the, the character of the role of a mother and advises her son about the hardships of life and encourages him to keep on continue struggle with patience and hope. The poem explores the dignity and determination of a mother who faces problem. That is a capsule summary or a reference to the context. When we are coming to the explanation, so we will say that in this stanza, the poet, the mother advises her son that, oh my son, you should, yeah, the, oh my son, all the time I continue, during my life, in the last four day, five day year, uh, during my life, I continued my struggle. I never lose heart. And I uh, continue walking uh, <coughs> or climbing on the ladder of life. And at least I have reached to the uh, top of the life which I want. I have uh, achieved my target. Uh, at the end, I have achieved my target. And uh, while reaching to the target, I have changed my way from different angle. Uh, I have turned different side uh, in order to reach my uh, uh, destination, in order to reach my destination. And he says that sometime I continued my uh, struggle for the high position in the night as well. I climbed, uh, I climbed on the a ladder of life on the ladder of life during night time where there nothing where nothing was visible on the way but anyhow i didn't lose courage i didn't take rest and i continue my struggle in order to reach the destination to reach the uh, top so uh, then he advises his son uh, her son that oh my son you should also follow my example and you shouldn't lose heart and you shouldn't turn back by saying that uh, uh, climbing is very difficult and there are a lot of splinter and there are a lot of nails and there are a lot of broken planes etc and i can't uh, climb on this uh, stair so don't do such thing. Continue your struggle like me and uh, try to reach the high position of uh, your life. Now the third stanza. Don't you sit down on the step. Tum step sirliyon ke sirliyon par bhi mat bed jau. Jo ladder hai iske mukhtalib jo sirliya hai is par mat bed jau. Cause you find it kinder hard. इसी वजह से कि आपको ये बहुत मुश्किल लगता है आगे जाना और आप बैठ जाए तो ऐसा न करो और डोंट यू फॉल नाउ आप नीचे भी न गिरो अब मतलब नीचे भी न जाओ फॉर आई सी स्टिल गोइंग आनी क्योंकि मैं अभी भी आगे जा रही हूँ मेरे प्यारे बेटे हनी मीन मेरे प्यारे बेटे आई सी स्टिल क्लाइंब इन और मैं अभी भी चलती हो ऊपर उरूज की जानब चलती हो and life for me ain't been no crystal stair और मेरे लिए भी जिंदगी एक साफ सुथरी सीढ़ी की तरह नहीं थी it was full of difficulties for me as well तो यही आखिर स्टेंजा था पेराप्रेज है in this stanza the mother advises her son by saying that oh my son don't sit in the middle of the your life stair by becoming disappointed, disappointed that it is difficult to climb in it and don't go back or fall from the middle of the life as well uh, yeah and don't uh, fall from the middle of the uh, from the middle of the stair as well if you think that uh, climbing is difficult and uh, you uh, fall down so that's also not uh, good and then uh, she says that I have throughout my life continue my struggle climbing on the ladder and now I being an old woman I am still climbing on the ladder of life. 
uh, so you should also keep courage and uh, go on the steer of life and uh, don't become discouraged and uh, uh, climbing is not very much easy but in order to reach your destination you have to do this these things so that was the short uh, paraphrase now explanation so again we will say uh, that uh, this stanza has been taken from the poem mother to son in this uh, yeah this stanza has been uh, yeah this poem has been composed by longston hughes in this uh, poem the poet uh, plays the role of a mother uh, who advises her son uh, that uh, oh my liar, oh my son you should continue your struggle you shouldn't lose hope keep your hope and uh, life is like a stair and you have to climb on the stair with the passage of time and at least uh, you will reach your target your destination if you continue your uh, if you continue your struggle your journey and then she gave her own example as well that throughout of my life i have continued my journey and that's why i have reached uh, to the destination and the high position uh, during the journey i have suffered a lot of difficulty so you also have to suffer a lot of difficulty because life is not an easy way to go on तो आप इस तरह भी लिख सकते हैं यही भी लिख सकते हैं जो भी आप लिख ले लेकिन कैप्सूल समरी अभी हम एक्सप्लेनेशन बयान कर लेंगे इन दिस टेंजा द मदर एडवाइस हर सन दैट ओ माय सन यू शुडंट लूज हार्ट एंड यू शुडंट सेट डाउन इन द मिडल ऑफ द स्टेयर इन द मिडल ऑफ द लेडर बाय थिंकिंग दैट इट इज वेरी डिफिकल्ट टू क्लाइम ऑन and you also uh, shouldn't come back yeah go down from uh, to the bottom of the uh, stair there by thinking that it is very difficult to go to climb on the stair and uh, you lose courage and come back so that is also not the solution of the uh, problem uh, you have to continue your journey uh, throughout your life uh, in order to reach the or uh, position uh, the high position because you see that life is not a bed of flower Uh, life, uh, a bunch of flower it is full there are a lot of thorns in the life as well and if you don't suffer these thorns these difficulties so it will be difficult for you to reach your destination and then she gives uh, her own example to the to her son they told my son look at my life now i am old and but i continued the journey of life successfully courageously and bravely and that's why i have reached to my target but although or despite the fact that i am old but still i continue my journey to all the uh, uppermost place and uh, i didn't lose heart so you also shouldn't lose heart a lot of difficulties obstacles will come in your life but you should bear all these thing these difficulty and, uh, and these difficulties and obstacle prepare you for the future uh, uh works are hard works so don't lose heart and continue your struggle and at last uh, you will become a successful man uh, because uh, on the whole life is not just like a crystal stair that uh, there it will be crystal clear and you will climb on very easily upon it so it is not uh, such thing is not there in life life is full of difficulty you should try your best to uh, uh, control all the difficulties and continue your struggle of life so isi tarah dear viewers whatever you write but you should keep the key tip in your the theme in your mind and uh, explain it Which, whatever come explanation is in so many ways that is the one way which i explained you can explain in another way in another way as well but keep the basic theme in mind and also dear uh, brother and students I try to share the videos with all first year students so that they could also benefit from them thank you so much khuda hafiz